We've hyper demonized deliverance to where it's, oh, it's the people that are, you know, like the legion of demons that's mm-hmm. in the cemetery and all this stuff. But it's in believers. The, the, the Jesus talk, it talks about how Jesus went into the synagogues and he performed deliverance on ordinary people. This was a normal thing for him. Mm-hmm. And it was something that was done in the book of Acts. It was something that was done all through the gospels. In the teaching that God gave to me to teach all the way through to bring us to that corporate deliverance really was teaching how does a believer come under the influence of a demonic influence, which is really what it means to be demonized is to be under the influence of Mm -hmm. a demon. So under the influence, which honestly, and I've had clients before where I'm like, you know, what if it's not actually you? What if there's a spirit of some sort that just kind of comes on you and they're like, oh my gosh, that would feel so relieving. Mm. Like there's relief in people. Yeah. Mm -hmm. To go, oh, wait a minute. Oh, wait a minute. That's not me. I'm not my enemy. Mm -hmm. That, well, no, because the Bible says flesh and blood is not your enemy. Mm -hmm. That powers of darkness and principalities is your enemy. (laughs) 